Hi, Carlitos. Good night. How are you? Fine, teacher. Good night. Fine. How, hey, that's how amazing. Was your day? That was pretty good, actually. It was really nice. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, do, do you. Do you. Uh, Did I what? Say? Are you, uh, uh, do you, Did you learn another, another uh, people in the morning? Yeah. Teach, uh, sorry. I taught, sorry. no, I, uh, I didn't teach uh, uh, anybody else, no. Uh -huh. uh, it's because I do have a different schedule. Uh, I have a different job during the day. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Exactly, and yes. at night I have you. <laughs> uh -huh. Yes, I know. I mean, I yeah, I, I yeah, I know. <laughs> yes. But I'm so happy to have you guys. Hey, Bree, how Bri. are you, girl? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Let me let's ask Bree Carlitos. But any chance, uh, did you uh, did you take a nap this afternoon? I take what? A nap. What is the meaning of what? A nap. <laughs> nap. A nap. nap. Remember that, for example, when you were a baby, your mama feed you, give, gave you a, a, a shower, and then she pampered you, and then she pulled you back on the bed, right? Around 10 a.m. or maybe in the afternoon. So there is not a specific time that we have to sleep, but we can take a nap. You know what nap is? <laughs> Okay, a nap, yeah. Oh. Okay. No, today, not today. Not today. I... Why not today? <laughs> huh? A nap. Nap. Because I I was very busy in oh. my job today. Oh, so you, you didn't have a day off today. It, actually, no. you worked today. Mm, mm, yes, oh. I worked um, uh, until 5 p.m. Oh, so but your schedule is already fixed. No, actually, no. But your schedule is like Frank. That is barriers. <laughs> no, no, no. no. I have a a, a schedule. A fixed schedule. No, I work uh, since eight a.m. until five p.m. every oh. day. So you work from from 8 a.m. Yes, until 5. Yes. You were from that Monday to Friday or all, all weekends as well? Monday to Friday and Saturday the, since 8 a.m. until 12. So you said, so you work from Monday to Friday from 8 to 5 and you work on Saturday half a day? Yes. Uh, from day. 8 a.m. until 12 noon. 12 noon, yes. Okay. So <laughs> give me the information again. So what is your schedule from Monday to Friday? You work from what time to what time? <laughs> you my can do it. Is, my schedule is a, a Monday, uh, Monday to Friday uh -huh. uh, since a Since or um, from? from? From. 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 Very okay. good. From a a. I know your baby. Yes. No, sorry. That's okay. No problem. I already get used to that noise. Okay. Don't worry about it. Okay. It's from a.m. until 5 p.m. P.m. Yes. And, and on Saturdays? Saturdays on, sa on Saturdays. On Saturday. On Saturday. Uh, from 8 a.m. until 12 of noon. Well, no. no, you can say until 12 or you can say well, until noon, either or. Okay. 12 p.m. or noon, either or. Okay, it sería 8 a.m. until noon. Very good. Excellent. Yes, that's right. Excellent job. Exactly. You're right about that. Woohoo! Great job, girl. All right. Let's... Thank you. No, no, that's good. You see, I, I, uh, you let me know. I want to speak fluently. I will... I'm going to help you on that. All righty. So that's cool. That's cool. Thank Excellent. You. My pleasure. What about Mr. Frank? Frank, what did you do today? Did anything special happen to you? No, teacher. Nothing. I'm still working. 
You're still I'm working. still working now. Ooh, I'm goodness. still working now. I know, I know that. But tell me, did you have any spe a special client today? I don't know. No, nothing? Only, no, only playing video games before to left. So may I ask you, did you receive many calls today or not? No, today was very fun. That's amazing. Sorry, I got a call. <laughs> ah, go ahead, go ahead, take your time, go ahead. All righty. So you can put yourself on mute. What about you, Alex? How was your day? What did you do today? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, class. Um, my day is is normally nothing in special. Nothing <laughs> special. Nothing but, special. But today. tell us something, Alex. At uh, what time did you wake up today? Oh. All, can you please all... give us your 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 journey or your schedule? What you okay. what you ha what have you done during your whole day since the time that you opened your beautiful eyes? Today? Okay. <laughs> um, uh, from Monday to Friday, um, it's, it's, wake up. Uh huh. No, but, but what about today? I want you. I want you to let us know what did you do today before today. English class? Yes. Mm, okay. I wake up. You wake up or you walk up? Walk up. Very I good. Up, um, 30 and a half a.m. What? Yeah, all all the all the days. At uh, what time you said? Can you please repeat it one more time? Yes. <laughs> At what time? Three and a half. Three and a half? Oh, okay. can you imagine, Brie? No way. Yeah, wow. Three and a half. Why you wake up so early? Girl. Yeah, you'll know, right? Because I travel to Santana, uh, mm. no, from Santana to Lourdes, Colombia. Okay, got it. I understand that. Oh my God, it'd be kind of a traffic, the right? The traffic is hey. very hard. Ugh, and horrible. Yeah. Um, because, um, holy, uh, okay. Uh, I, 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 guess, I, guess, <laughs> I start to work. Um, you start seven, to work. Uh -huh. start to work. Um, seven, At, seven a quarter a.m. Seven a quarter or what? You mean a uh, fifteen minutes to seven or se or oh, fifteen minutes past seven? Uh, fifteen minutes past seven. Ah, okay, cool. Okay. Yeah. Um. Then. Um. Only work. <laughs> okay, so what uh, did the, uh, what did you do? The first thing that you did in, in, at work? Did you check up your emails? Okay, I no. The first one I check the the assistants. Um, the people. Okay. Assistant okay. people. Okay. Uh, balance. Mm -hmm. okay. Balance. Balance the work areas and. And then check my mails uh, mm -hmm. and review the reports for mm -hmm. the uh, today, Friday, uh, review report for the weeklies. Reports. Uh, we weekly reports. Weekly reports. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, this day I um, close the shipments, uh, exportation. Shipments, shipments, yes. Shipments. Shipments. Okay. Shipments, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, this day, cloud the shipments. Um, tomorrow, uh, Saturday, and in the next so in in the Sunday, I uh, descanse. Eh? <laughs> I have I have a day off. A day off. Yes, yeah, exactly. So you work from Monday to Friday. Yeah, only work off. Monday to Friday. Woo -woo. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. That's good. Okay. Uh, did you already have your uh, dinner or not? Um, do you already sorry? have dinner? Okay, yeah. I I I um, llegar, llegar, I arrived. Arrive. I arrived. I arrived in my house to six or six and a half p.m. and and then dinner after class. Oh, so you arrived no, before bef before, antes, before 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 class. So you arrived back home. Yeah. You arrive back home at 6.30, you said? Yeah. 
All righty. So you're going to have the dinner after today's class? No, before class. Oh, so you already have your dinner? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what oh. about your cup of coffee? Yes, it's, it's, it's <laughs> uh, in, in, a, in a moment. <laughs> in a moment. I, well, tell your son that we need two cups more for Carlitos and for me. They can give, yeah. virtually we can give it no problem i wish it could be live <laughs> but uh, no we cannot do it right so yeah we're gonna get okay. used to like virtual coffee all right that was awesome very good job alex i know right Thanks. guys it's complicated right yeah. it's complicated not only to remember everything that we have done during the day but at the same time guys to remember the um, the verbs i'm yeah. asking you that so guys because we need to practice verbs Sometimes know the words in in in, in, in but the but not in English. <laughs> <laughs> no, lo voy a decir en español. No, nope. por ejemplo, no, 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 no. Okay. No. Do I your know, best in English. Okay, I know. Uh, uh, llegar in Spanish uh, is arrive in English, but the forget on on, on only. Yeah, I know, I know. That's why I ask you to speak because that's yeah. the only way that you will learn how to like practice pop pronunciation and fluency. Yeah. I know, that's cool. But you know what? Mm -hmm. You did a good job because actually you express yourself very clearly with the words and the verbs that you know so far. That's cool. That's yes. cool. Don't worry. That's We're here just to, to learn. That's why I ask you about that. You're going to learn to like explain yourself uh, maybe in a different way with a different verbs later on, but that's okay. That's what I ask you every time, guys. Doesn't matter. Today we're gonna finish with the simple past tenses, but it doesn't matter if next week we're gonna learn something new. Every day I'm gonna ask two or three people to let me know how was your day because we would need to continue practicing the past because this, this is one of the verbs tenses that um, is complicated for for most of the people. Why, guys? Because um, uh, Salvadorians or Latin people, we are really crazy sometimes, right? Because uh, we start talking about present, then we go back to, hey, you know what? And I remember the last time when you start talking about the past, and then you move on to the future, and you were like, well, I don't know what you're talking about. He's talking about this, 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 what's going on? So we are like that. And you know what? You can do it. In English, you can do it. However, before you try to mix it up verb tenses, you need to learn how to speak very well one verb tense. How to use correctly the present tense. How to use correctly the past tense. How to use correctly the future tense. When you know how to do it and when you are handled this and, we are, and when you feel comfortable with that, then you will be able to mix it up. But right now, no. So right now, guys, I want you like, if you're talking about the past, stay in the past. Don't mix verb tenses. Not right now. We're, we're going to do it later on, but not today. Okay? I know it will be really hard because Salvadorians, we mix all verb tenses. Hey, you know what? Today I did something, but I remember that she told me that. And you were like, okay. So are you talking about present? Are you talking about past or what? But very good. Great job, Alex. I'm so proud of you. Very good. I'm going to give you, you broke my heart. Very good. Excellent job. All righty, guys. I'm so happy because uh, we're going to uh, review. Hey, Jorjito. Yay. I'm so happy to have you back. Woohoo. You see, we're going to have a party today. All right, guys. Guys, let me ask you something. Uh, do you have... um? Do you, do you receive the classes or are you logging with your cell phone or with your computer? May I ask you that? Computer. Computer. Also, I think we need to, your cell phone. Bunny, uh, what about Brie? With your cell phone or with your computer or with your laptop? My cell phone. Your cell phone. What about you, Carlitos? I think you're with computer, right? I think so. Also, Jorjito. What about you, Nelsie? Cell phone. cell phone everybody may i ask you something do you have any other device that you can uh, search for information besides the cell phone or is the only thing that you have right now 
No, I have a computer. A computer. All right. Uh, okay. Okay, cool. So uh, I think only a few yes. of you will, will be able to play. But don't worry, guys. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave. Um, I will leave this game for a month, okay? Just to give just to have you time. Okay. Yes. Why? Because I would like to practice to review as a game. We're gonna play an interactive game on Monday about what we have seen this week. Okay. But I want you guys to do me a favor. If you're able to have a different device, like cell phone and a computer, that would be amazing. Because this game is um, what can I say? Okay, I will give you like a link for you to like log in into the game because it's an interactive game. But in your cell phone, for example, you will be able to see only the colors because there will be like a several questions and the possible answers will be in colors. However, you're not gonna see any letters. You're gonna see only the colors. The answers, you will be, you're gonna see it on my computer. On the information that I'm sharing with you. Do you understand that? Yes. Or no? Bane? Yes. Bane, Bane, Bane. Maravilla. Alex? Maravilla. Maravilla. Okay, let me see if I. Maravilla. I don't want to speak Spanish because you're going to laugh about me, <laughs> but I will do my best. <laughs> I will do my best. Um, Let me switch my, ca my cassette, right? My DVD, my brain DVD. Um, um, ah, yes, <laughs> you know what? It's really hard to think in another language, the one that you're used to, to speak every single day. All right. I, I remember when I was speaking the three languages at the same time, goodness, that was like, remember that there's like a pen that has like a lot of kinks. You click and then you have the black color. You click again and you have the blue one. You click and you have the green mm -hmm. one. So I had exactly the same on my mind. English, Spanish, French, English, Spanish. Oh my goodness, all the time. That was horrible. Okay. Um, el lunes. Eh, I can say lunes. <laughs> <laughs> all righty. Oh, whoops. El lunes. Um, vamos a, um, a revisar lo que hemos visto esta semana. Sí. Entonces, es, ¿Será con un juego interactivo? Yes. Sí, interactive game. Eh, pero necesito que ustedes tengan dos dispositivos. Devices. Devices son dispositivos. Devices. Así se le dice a las cosas tecnológicas. Por ejemplo, si tú tienes una tablet y tú tienes un cell phone, son two devices. ¿Sí? Así se dice. Es una palabra tecnológica. All right. Entonces, ¿por qué? Porque uh, en un device, suponte que es el cell phone, tú vas a logarte a la, a, a la página web que yo te voy a mandar y tú le vas a entrar un pin que yo te voy a dar y vas a poner tu nickname, que tu nickname puede ser como un apodo. Puedes decir Bane, Nelsi, eh, Pikachu, I don't know, Hello Kitty, Winnie Pooh, whatever. Okay? Use your imagination, right? All right. Yeah, and, pero el problema estará en que cuando tú te logues, tú vas a ver las preguntas en el, del juego, pero no vas a ver las respuestas. Lo único que vas a ver son los colores. Va a ser un color verde, azul, amarillo y rojo. ¿Sí? Los cuatro. Entonces tú dices, bueno, teacher, entonces, ¿cuál es la respuesta? Ah, tú vas a ver la respuesta en mi pantalla, cuando yo te comparta mi pantalla. Entonces, lo que tú tienes que hacer, porque ese, ese juego lleva tiempo, vas a ver mi pantalla, lo vas a ver rapidito, y en tu dispositivo, clic, le vas a dar en la que tú creas correcta, ¿sí? Pero en tu dispositivo verás colores. En mi pantalla verás las respuestas, ¿sí? Por eso es que yo quiero dos devices. Y como lleva tiempo, y son segundos, ¿eh? Son lo más unos, ¿qué? Unos... 20 segundos, a lo mucho. Entonces, tienes que... Don't be like that, Alex. I need a cup of coffee, by the way. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ¿Me entiendes? ¿Me, me di a entender? Yeah? Yes, yes. Ah, yes, good. Finally. <laughs> okay. Yes. Muchas gracias. The, 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 this language is better. <laughs> el, el, ¿El español es mejor? 
¿Ya? Uh, oh, oh, yes. Oh, yes. <risa> no, no, sabes, es complicado. Es complicado. I know, I know. I watch the TikTok when say, how do you say eh, estamos? Oh, my God, the, 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 the guys, eh, how do you say tirar los libros? Oh my God, this Spanish is bad. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Por ejemplo, tienes mucho Horrible. Latino America, right? Pero um, el español es complicado porque hay muchas modalidades regionales. Solo en Centroamérica tenemos muchísimos. Por ejemplo, um, si yo digo que alguien está tras las rejas, Aquí en El Salvador puedes decir estás tras las rejas o está preso o presa, ¿no? Pero si tú vas a Costa Rica, presa puede ser tanto la persona que está en las rejas como cuando estás hablando de una gran trabazón. Y yo, yo decía, ¿y por qué te tardas? Es que había una presa. Una presa y al principio yo dije, bueno, ¿y este por qué fue a, fue a visitar a alguien en la cárcel? ¿Y qué? Estaban hablando del tráfico. No, es like, ok. Ajá. O, por ejemplo, acá, cuando tú vas a la escuela, es una mochila, ¿no? Una mochila. Pues allá es bulto. Pásame el bulto. Yo, bulto. Para mí, bulto es una cosa que te estorba, que no te permite pasar, ¿no? Pero allá, allá es bulto, es una mochila. ¿Ves? Entonces, para el extranjero, aprender español es complicado. No solo porque um, muchos países europeos la cultura es muy fría, ¿sí? Y los latinos somos muy apapachados, muy bailongos, muy, uh, muy amorosos, muy friendly, muy es going, right? Pero ellos no. Entonces... No le puedes decir, ¿verdad? También incluso al principio, si tú ves a alguien, no le dices, ¿qué hubo? ¿Cómo está? No, tampoco, ¿verdad? Entonces, hay como ciertas cosas. Me acuerdo que así pasó con mi profesor de francés. Verás que algún día te contaré la historia. Eh, pero acá en El Salvador, por ejemplo, para esto, si no se te viene a la cabeza qué es, puedes decir, pasame ese chunche, cuenterete, volado. Volado. ¿Idea? Voladito. Ajá, exactly. Voladote. Ajá, uh -huh. you're like, what? what? <laughs> That's why for, um, hey, muchas gracias por el español. ¿Ven que mejora un poquito? <laughs> a veces cuando hablo español, si hablo mucho, tengo un acento así como medio costarricense, mexicano, guatemalteco y colombiano. Ahí, ahí. Algún día les hablaré <laughs> más. <laughs> yes, all righty. Oh, sí. Entonces, going back to English, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Thank you so much. Because for me, it's important. <laughs> I speak more English than the Spanish. All righty. So, but hey, how was my Spanish? Was it good? Great to go. Yay! Thank you. So happy. Yeah. <laughs> All righty. So, guys, so <laughs> now, <laughs> so thank you. So now you know that for yeah. Monday, we will need this, okay? For that activity. For Monday, two devices. For, yes, two devices, because we're going to need them. All right, guys, now may I ask you something? Um, well, hey, what is today, by the way? Thank you so much. Uh, Brie, can you please write it down today's date, please, if you don't mind? I knew it. Today is... No, write it down on the chat. Ah, okay, okay. Please, but don't take the whole, the whole class, okay? <laughs> okay, guys. Wait until um, she wrote everything. Oh, okay. Okay, Nelsie, no problem. I understand. Yeah, I have a, a power down today in, uh, during my shift. I was scared by heart. Okay, Brie, hurry up. <sighs> She's right in today's day, guys. So everybody, we're going to double check. Okay, she said August 27th, Friday, 2021. Is that correct? Is that correct? Yes or no? No. Yes. No. 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 <laughs> Why not? No. Because it's Friday, August 7th, 
Don't forget the capital letter, please, okay. of today's date. Okay. Never forget. She she just finished work it out right now, Tanya, right? Yeah. Okay. Sassy was here, but she got so she's gone. It's Friday. Uh -huh. Friday Tell Chile that helps you. <laughs> 27th. Friday, yes, okay. Friday, coma, August. Almost perfect, Tanya, except for one thing. The period? No. Oh, no. Uh, the capital letter of August. The, the August. Yeah, I have that problem because in Spanish, someone told me that I need to use the capital letter. Uh, but you just, no, this. I don't know if it is a small letter in the lower, Spanish. Lower case. Low, low, lower, lower case, case. Lower case letter in Spanish. And I confused now because uh, almost the time I write, uh -huh, that's the reason I need to practice. <laughs> yes, no, that's why. Yes, you have to use uh, lower cases in lower the middle case. of, 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 uh, of the sentences, guys. Also, it's in the Spanish, the same uh, rule. However, Tani, that rules mm -hmm. only is a uh, used if there's it's not proper name all proper names for example uh, names of country names of people names of um month of mm -hmm. the year all proper mm -hmm. names doesn't matter yeah. where they go all of them will be in capital letters in capital it, it, letter. even though in spanish as well yeah you are right mm -hmm. <laughs> so that's why okay. but you see that's good. All right. Very good, Alex. Mm -hmm. Except for one thing. You're missing the period well, in the end. Period in the end. Yeah. Ah, the period. See, you, guys, I'm, I'm, I'm so happy right now because you see, you're mm -hmm. trying to write and that's a, awesome. And that's it's, a, awesome. It's, a, it's a sample about things. Exactly. So, <laughs> so guys, that's why I'm happy because now, guys, that you're trying to, to write yourself are identifier your mistakes. And that is good because once you identify, oops, I forgot the period. Oops, I forgot the capital letter. Oops, I forgot the day, like Brie, right? I forgot the day. Oh, you know, oh, I, oh, you switch it up, right? You put it in a different way. Yeah. So now you identified it and you said, hey, you have it over here. That is the way that is corrected. But of course, it will make a mistake. But that's what I'm asking you. Practice, practice. That's what I'm going to ask you every single day until we'll finish this model. I'm gonna ask you to write it down. But, it, but at the end of the class, at the end of the model, you're gonna, you're gonna write it down correctly, I promise that. So you see, Alex, now you almost have it perfect, except for the period, good job. Okay. Next time, you're not gonna forget the period. And next time, Tony, you're not gonna forget the capital letter. And next time, Brie, you're not gonna forget the Friday will be the first that you need to write it down. Awesome, very good job, guys, excellent. Applause, applause to everybody. Woohoo! Let's celebrate. Yay! And you broke my heart. Very good job, guys. Excellent. I'm so proud of you. All right, guys. So I'm gonna we're going to start uh, developing our listening skill today. Okay. And what I want you to do, guys, is that you pay attention to a composition. Oh, but before I do that, do you remember, guys, that I, I sent you a list of verbs, right? And as well, yesterday, we practiced about the writing, right? When we need to double. We saw the rules. Do you remember that? We saw the rules and everything? Okay. Yes, teacher. All righty. And I told you yesterday, I remember, guys, that I will, uh, that we're going to practice the, the writing of of, of the regular and irregular verbs today. So we can double check when we need to put the ED, when we need to uh, double the, the letters, etc. So I, I just chosen, I have chosen like a few, a few verbs. I have mixed it up, regular and irregular verbs. And I'm gonna show it to you right now. And I want you guys to let me know 
what will be the past tense of those verbs. Sometimes uh, there are some verbs that is in present tense and you need to let me know the past of the verbs. But there are some columns on some verbs that are only in the past form and you need to let me know which is the present tense, okay? We're gonna work on that right now. Isn't it amazing? Are you ready? Are you so happy? I know. Gosh, <laughs> everybody's like, mm, nah. <laughs> yes, but don't worry, everything's gonna be all right. So allow me just a couple of minutes. Oops, there you go. Okay, let me share right now my screen with you. Okay. Can you see it, guys? Can you see it or no? Yes, yes, I okay. see it. Yes, you can see it. All right, that's yeah, awesome. That's All right, guys. So the first one is easy, right? The person is walk. What is the meaning of walk? Walk it. Walk it. No, what is the meaning? I mean, what is the meaning? I mean, okay. What is the path of walk? Walk. 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 Walked. Listen, walk. walked. walked. This walk, one walk. is in the list that I gave you. Walked. All right. Walk. Uh -huh. Be careful with the pronunciation. All right. All right. What is the what is the uh, the meaning of go? Here. 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 Yeah. What is the path of go? Went. 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 Excellent. Went. Okay. And now this is starting mm -hmm. new. Good job. Okay. I have here road. Road. Right. 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 What is the present? Right. 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 Ah, right. listen carefully the pronunciation. Right. 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 Because right. if you say right, right, I can hear right. Right. Right is that. Right. And right is when you right. go into a motorcycle, right? Right. Very good. Okay. Right. Speak. <laughs> what is it? Hablar. 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 Okay. What's the passage speak? What? Ah, no, 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 no. Yeah, 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 it's correct. It's correct, the past. But what I don't like is the pronunciation. Why you say that spoke? There is no S there. There is no S. Uh -huh. uh, if, when you pronounce it, for me, it's like this. But do you remember that in English there is no e at the beginning, right? It's just this. Is that correct? So I don't want you guys to say this spoke. No, spoke. Spoke. Look at look on my teeth. Spoke. 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 Oof! Thanks, God. It would be like Sylvester. Spoke. Spoke. You see. What you gonna do? Remember that when you have oh. a flat tire, it's like, psst, right? Spook. So spoke. So if, if you said a spook, it will be like hechizado, spooky. So so it's a spoke. Spoke. Okay, repeat after me. Speak. Speak. No, no quiero ir la e. Speak. 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 Very good. Speak. Speak. Spoke. 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 Very good. Tienes que ver mi boca. Ves que yo solamente muerdo los labios y de ahí trato de salir un, un silbidito. Speak. Spoke. Speak. 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 Very good. Spoke. Puede que te duela la boca. I know that. Pero de, al, ya después te va a salir normal. Pero al principio vas a tener que exagerar un poquito. Speak, speak, spoke, spoke. Very good. Speak, spoke. Mira que diez años el call center no son de balde. Este oído está horriblemente triste. Este oído es horrible. Mi oído está muy, muy developed. All right, very good, excellent. ¿Saben por qué es complicated? Because Why? that sound, we do not have it in, English, in Spanish. We don't have that s sound. We have the S sound, but not that s sound. So that's the reason why it's, it's hard for us, but we can do it. Okay, now this, the next one, thought, 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 thought. Remember when you have a TH together, it's like Z as in zebra. 
Look at look at my mouth. Thought. 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 Very good. All right. So what's the past of thought? Think. 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 Very good. Think. Excellent. All right. Practice. Think. Practice. 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 What's the pause of practice? Practice. 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 Very good. Yeah, very good. You have to study the regular verbs. What about play? What's the pause of play? Played. 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 Very good. Played. Played. Built. Played. What is built? It's the same. Built. Construir. Build. Construir. Construyó. So what's the present of build? The build. same build. No, it's not the same. No, yeah, it's build on with the end in the end. Exactly. Build. Listen carefully. Build. 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 Very good. Build. Build. Okay. All right. Next. Win. When you're Win. champion. One. Uh -huh. One. 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 One very good. Spend. spend. What's the present? Spend. spend. With the spend. spend. With the end. With the end. Uh, we're spend. gonna write spend. it down as well. There you go. Spend. There you go. All right. What about save? Save. 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 With, save. with D, right? With D. Excellent save. job. Save. All right. What about worry? Worry. 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 Then we have worry, right? All right. Worry. Worry. It's not the worry. same, actually, with this. Worry. Remember? Worry. Uh huh. Very good. Okay, great. Great job, guys. Excellent. You have a study. You have a study. I'm so happy about that. We need to, you, you're learning a new, a new vocabulary, right? So, what was the meaning of build, you said? What does it mean, build? Construir. Construir. Okay. What is the meaning of worry? Preocuparse. Very good, very good. What is the meaning of play? Jugar, jugar. All righty. Jugar. Uh-huh, excellent. What is the meaning of uh, practice? Practicar. Practicar. What about win? Bien, ganar. Champion. Very good. What, is, what about save? Uh -huh. What about ride? Uh-huh. But you know what? We, because guys, we don't we cannot say we ride a car, no. We drive a car, right? We use ride when we're talking about a specific type of transportation, such as motorcycles, bicycles and camels as well camels Horse. and horses all right that's what we are como montar, exactly yes Vani. that's right yeah good job very good so we have practice right now now guys it's time for develop the listening skill what i want you guys to do um i'm not going to ask you about a specific question uh, because we're, there will be another listening activity, another listening skill for develop. But right now, what I want you to pay attention is about the conversation. This conversation is in the past. This conversation is in the past. And basically, what I want you guys to pay attention is to let me know what is it, which activities or what the people that they are talking to, what they have done during the weekend. That's what I want. Just listen, just give me that information, what they have done during the weekend. That's all that I need. And I'm gonna be really nice because this week, and what that means today, <laughs> I'm gonna play it three times. But next week, I will play all the audios only two times. And the third week and the fourth week, I'm gonna play it all until one time, okay? Don't look at me like that. Like, okay? Like, eh, right, Georgie? Okay. <laughs> All righty. Are you guys ready? Yeah, okay. I know that you're ready. Woohoo. All righty. So let me share my screen with you guys. All righty.
yes, I'm going to share the audio because if not, you will be able to listen. All right. Okay, guys, I want 100% focus and I don't want any distractions, please. I don't want any noises. All righty. All right. Very good. There you go. Okay, let's play. It. Unit 7. We had a great time. Page 44, Exercise 2, Conversation. Did you do anything special? Part A. Listen and practice. So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. How fun! Did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our test is today? I forgot about that. Don't worry. You always get an A. All right. One more time. One more time. Yes. Yes. I, I, you, nobody said yeah, it, it, anything, right? So you want me to play one yes, more time? Teacher. Okay, okay. That's what I want. If nobody said anything, I'm going to ask you. Okay? <laughs> I will give you two more times. There you go. Pay attention, guys. Unit 7. We had a great time. Page 44, Exercise 2, Conversation. Did you do anything special? Part A. Listen and practice. So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. How fun! Did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our test is today? I forgot about that. Don't worry. You always get an A. All right, one more time or no? It's okay? Hello, Houston, do we have a problem here? One more time, guys, or no? Okay, nobody said anything. Let's go back. All right, may I ask? Tell me something. What was the dialogue about? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. The dialogue was great time. The the title. Uh huh. Yeah. But about what they are talking about. How what what they, they did. Uh huh. They did. Mm -hmm. What they did. Weekend. They did of the weekend. Uh huh. The weekend. What did they do on what the happened? weekend? What did they do? Yeah. All righty. <laughs> okay. Yes. Yeah. Excellent. And tell me something. What did they do? Um, she... she went to the party. To the... She went to the karaoke bar. Uh -huh. Does everybody agree? May. Yes. And and she uh, and she wish. was to the new place on downtown. Uh, uh, and downtown. she was, so she was visited. What I don't get it. She she, she visited. She was she visited. visited. She visited. And you know what? I don't believe you guys. Okay, uh, May. Uh -huh. May. May, uh, uh, she had a great time. Okay. Uh, I remember the she went to the uh, karaoke bar. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes, and when? Uh, and when? And when you... she went? But and when? What date of the week? Saturday. 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 Excellent. Oh my God! What a good memory. Okay. Uh -huh. Hey. Uh, mm -hmm. Now everybody like, mm -hmm. <laughs> all right, excellent. What about uh, what about the guy? What's the name of the guy? Oh yes, Rick. Okay, what about Rick? Hey, Rick, he he, he was at home. He home. Stay home. Stay home. Why? Stay home stay all day because he needs to study for the Spanish test. Uh huh. For the first one. Uh huh. 
for Spanish yes, test. Study for the Spanish um, test. Yes. All righty, excellent. So now, very good. And uh, did, did she remember, uh, Meg, about the, uh, the test or no? Yeah. Yeah. I know she don't You're remember. She, she, don't, she, she, she didn't, she didn't she remember. She, she didn't remember. remember. She, forgot. She, didn't she, didn't remember. she forgot about that, right? But did she have to worry about that or no? No. Why not? Because, because of the time uh, she have a uh, eight. She got an eight. Very good. She got an eight. Mm -hmm. All righty, okay. awesome. So now, guys, I want you guys to take a look and uh, continue listening to the rest of the conversation. Very good job. And what I want you guys to let me know now is basically what does Meg do, but on Sunday afternoon. Sunday Sun afternoon. Sunday afternoon. Exactly. I want you guys to pay attention on that. And then you're gonna let me know what is she, what does she do right, basically. All righty, so long but just a couple of minutes. Very good job, guys. Good observation. Good, good listening. There you go. Page 44, exercise two, part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What does Meg do on Sunday afternoons? So, Meg, what did you do on Sunday? I stayed home in the morning. I just watched TV and read. How about in the afternoon? Oh, I worked. I have a part-time job at the university bookstore. I didn't know you had a job. Yeah, I'm a cashier there. I work every Sunday from 2 to 5. Uh-huh. You want to play one more time? Yes, please. All right. Yes, please. Yes, please. All right. Page 44, exercise 2. Part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What does Meg do on Sunday afternoons? So, Meg, what did you do on Sunday? I stayed home in the morning. I just watched TV and read. How about in the afternoon? Oh, I worked. I have a part-time job at the university bookstore. I didn't know you had a job. Yeah, I'm a cashier there. I work every Sunday from 2 to 5. All right. So let me ask you guys, what does Meg do every Sundays? Good morning. Meg, good yes. morning. Watch the morning. What about in the afternoon? Exactly. What does she do there? Cashier. 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 Oh, very good. Okay, she is a cashier, right? So every Sunday afternoon, she works. Two. Did a did a two and five. Exactly. Two to five. Two to five. So it's a full time job. It's a part time job. It's a part time job. Very good. Very good. Part time. From two to five. From two to five. Yeah. Very good. Okay, guys. Everybody, from two to five. One more time. From two to five. Everybody. From two to five. From two to five. Two to five. From two to five. From two to five. From two to five. I want everybody that to see your mouth. From two to five. Yeah. From two to five. Very good, Bunny. Nelsie, from two to five. From two to five. Very good, Alex. From two to five. From two to five. Yeah. Ah. Uh, I'm sorry about your wife. Okay. It doesn't mean anything. No, Dina, from two to five. From two to five. Very good, Carlitos. From two to five. From two to five. Very good, Jorgito. From two to five. Two to five. Ah, no, no, no. From two to five. From two to five. Very good, Tanya. From two to five. From two to five. Very good, Bree. From two to five. From two to five. Very good, Frank. From two to five. Hopefully, he has finished the call. No, he's still in the call. Oops, sorry about that. So that happens. I know that. I'm sorry for him. Yeah, I remember those days. Are you still in the call, Frank? Ah, oh, yes, he is still in the call. Okay, cool. That's okay. I understand. Don't worry about that. 
All righty, very good, excellent guys. That, why am I asking you to remember that or to practice that? Because you gotta be fluent, okay? Two to five, yes, I know, but sometimes we need to like speed a little bit more from two to five, yeah? From two, that's why I ask you. Very good job, guys. Excellent, amazing, good job. Now guys, uh, let's practice something. Uh, 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 what is going to be your homework before I forget? Before I forget. Yeah, good job. You see, Alex is happy. Excellent. Okay, your job, your homework will be this one, guys. And I want you guys to think about your last vacation. Your last vacation. And I want you guys to answer these following questions. I think I'm going to send it through the WhatsApp right now. So allow me just a couple of minutes. I'm going to send it to you the questions that I want you. Well, you can answer all of them if you want to, but it will give you like a guidance. You know, you know what guidance is, guys? I don't know. What, what you do don't you mean know what guidance is? No? Yeah. Guidance como guía, right? Yeah, guías, guidance, yes. guidance. Uh, it's, it is like a guía, right? Because it, you don't have to like do like question, answer, question, answer, no. No, you can do it like that in the beginning, but I want you guys that after you answer all the questions that I, I'm about to send it to you, um, I want you to, to do like a, a small paragraph just for five sentences. That would be enough. Well, the, usually the paragraph has only four sentences. Okay. And, and I want five you minutes. guys, yes, or five. So you can like um, describe in that little paragraph your vacation. That's it. It's not complicated, but I will give you the question because the question will be, will help you to like to, to write the information that you need. And then with that information is gonna help you to create your paragraph, okay? So that's why I'm giving you that. So okay. let me just a couple of minutes. There you go. And I'm, I'm searching for those questions for you right now. Our vacation and yeah, our last before or after COVID. Now remember your last vacation. Ah, okay. Yes, your last vacation. Ah, I know that most of the time was before <laughs> COVID, right? So okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yes. All right. Yeah, I know. So I'm I am gonna send it to you right now. So just a love it one moment. There you go. Okay, guys, I have sent it to you right now. Hopefully everybody is in the, in the group, right? So this is the question. These are the questions that I want you guys to like uh, answer. For example, where do you spend your last vacation? That is the first one. How long was your vacation? Who were you with? I mean, you, are, you were alone or with your family, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your husband, your wife, I don't know, your pets also. What did you do, of course? How was the weather? And what would you like to do on your next vacation? Okay, all right. So basically you can follow, you can answer each sentence question, but I want you guys to like construct why, guys, I'm giving you these exercises? Not only because it's going to be speaking, you're going to practice the writing. And it's really important that you learn or remember how to construct a sentence, paragraph that has coordination, that have logic, because when you, fit, when you take your TOEIC or your TOEFL, that is one of the tests of English that we do have to evaluate the English level, there is a part in oh. writing that we evaluate. And most of the people fails. Why? Because they don't have um, coordination, they missing vocabulary, they forgot punctuation, they don't have linking words, whatever. So that's why I'm giving you these exercises for you to start doing it correctly since right now. Okay, so that's why, because on the TOEIC and the TOEFL, you have time. And there will be like really interesting topics that you need to write about. So that's why I want you guys to get used to it from now on. Okay, so is it clear? Yeah, the, the homework? Yeah? 
Yes, and teacher. any doubts, mm -hmm. any questions, please feel free to ask me right now. This homework is for the next Monday. Yes, Alex, it's for Monday. Okay. And if you see, yes, and if you see, guys, everything will be, re you need to talk about the past. Okay, so you will need yeah. to put in practice everything that we have seen right now. Uh, the yeah. questions with uh, with B, with D, the WH question with B and with D, the paths of the verbs, uh, irregular verbs, the irregular verbs. So everything you will need to put in practice. Affirmative sentences, negative sentences, ooh, punctuation. There's a lot of things. Your imagination. Yes. Well, uh, teacher, teacher, yes, the, uh, the send, uh, we, will, we will send the... No. The no, homework no. for the... No. Nothing. No. No. I, okay. You're going to present it during the class. Ah, okay. We it's going to be verbally. Talk. Yes. We will we'll speak. be speaking. Will, exactly. It, but you know what? I would prefer if you try to use your notes as less as possible. Okay. If you if you want to use it, that's okay. Yes, like because uh, oops, I forgot, right? But I want you guys to try to get used to uh, do not use your notes too much. Okay. Yeah, I know that it will be really hard. Yes, Bree, go ahead, Bree. No, I'm just saying okay. Ah, okay, okay. I, I, I thought you were gonna ask something. Okay, that's cool. All right, guys. Any questions? No, everything is okay. Cool. No. Okay, now guys, we will continue practicing, but this time is going to be something different because um, most of the time we, we, when we're talking about past, we use deed, right? Deed, and you emphasize on deed. But when we speak, guys, sometimes we do not, use, we, we know that it's there, but when you pronounce it, it's, it's really like, like, it's like um, how you say that reduction, it's reduction. So we're going to practice right now that pronunciation, okay? We're gonna focus on that right now. So what I'm gonna do right now is to share with you that information. Let me double check here really quickly. I have it here, I have it here, here we go. Okay, we're gonna listen to the reduction of did you, okay? And then, especially guys, when we're talking about just no question and double S questions, and then we're gonna practice them, all right? Okay, so let me right now play the audio. First, guys, I'm gonna give it to you only the audio, two times. And the third time, I'm gonna um, share with you the questions, so you will be able to read, and at the same time, you will be able to listen. All righty, guys, so bear with me for a moment. <laughs> Let me check if it's this one I'm looking for. No, it's not this one I'm looking for. I got this one. There you go. This is what I need. There you go. Okay, that's the one that I need. Let me share right now my screen with you guys. Oops. There you go. Exercise four. Can you listen, guys? Yes or no? Yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Okay, listen carefully, please. Four. Pronunciation. Reduction of did you. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice how did you is reduced in the following questions. Did you have a good time? What did you do last night? How did you like the movie? You want to play one more time? Okay, guys, second yes, time. Please. Second time. Okay, cool. Page 45. <laughs> Exercise 4. Pronunciation. Reduction of did you. Part A. Listen and practice. Notice how did you is reduced in the following questions. Did you have a good time? What did you do last night? How did you like the movie? All right. It's interesting, right? Yes. Now, guys, this is the first time because it's really, it's really hard when you just listen something and sometimes you quite understand what is the question that they're asking for. Right now, we're gonna do uh, another exercise 
that is going to help us also develop our listening skill. But at the same time, we're going to de start developing our reading skill. Okay, so we're going to work two things because it will be is easy guys when you have something in writing and at the same time you're listening but it's hard when you have nothing in writing and you just listened so and right now that your brain is already a little bit trained i will share right now with you the writing part and i'm gonna play the audio one more time so i want you guys to focus on the listening but also try to read at the same time okay all right, uh, let me just a couple of minutes. There you go. Do, 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 do. There you go. There you go. You yes. Go ahead. Are you going to say something, Carlitos? Oh, nothing to show. Okay, okay. In this moment, I, I am sleep. <laughs> you're sleeping. No way. You're not going to sleep. Yeah. We almost finished. We almost finished. Just one more minute. All right. <laughs> Guys, did you receive some, what I sent it to you right now? So the WhatsApp, I sent it to you. You got it? Yeah? Yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Okay, guys, so let's go back. Let me play the audio one more time. And please pay attention to the ex um, question that you have th there. You have three questions. Page 45, exercise four, pronunciation. Reduction of did you. Did you. Part A, listen and practice. Notice how did you is reduced in the following questions. <laughs> did you have a good time? What did you do did last you night? What did you do how did last? you like the movie? How did you? How did all you? right. All right. Very like good. So let's practice. Let's practice right now. Let me share right now on my screen with you. Did you notice that? Or this is this, it, most of the time the WH question is where you do not pronounce or you reduce the pronunciation of did. So let me just a couple of minutes. Did you? Right. There you go. Let's practice. What that. did you? Mm -hmm. Oh, did you? All right. Very good. Can, can everybody see us my screen? Yeah. Okay. Cool. So yes. let's practice. Do you have a good time? Repeat after me. Do you have a good time? Do you have a good time? Do you have a good, good time? Do you have a good time? Do you have a good time? What did you do last night? What did you do? What did you last do night? last night? No, I don't want you to pronounce the deed. I know that you are there. I, I know the deed is there, but I want you guys not to emphasize the deed. Try to pronounce it as fast as you can. What did you do last night? What did you do last night? Very good. What did you do last night? How do you like the movie? 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 Do you, like the movie? Like the movie? Do, you do you have a good time? Did you, did you have, have a good time? time? You have a, did you have a good time? What time? What did you do last night? What, what did you do, do last night? night? How do you like the movie? How did you like, did you like the like movie? The movie? Yes. You see, you I, you know that the deed is there, but when you pronounce it, it's reduction. Yeah. What did you do last night? How do you like the movie? How do you? Oh, how do you like the movie? Yeah, very how good, like movie? very good. How do you? Like and it's helping you with the pronunciation. It's very fast. I know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, but that's why we're practicing you, right now. Do you, you like you, it? You. Yes, yes, I, I like, it. I like yes. it. Yeah, that will help you with the speedness, okay? And the pronunciation. Guys, I know that you love me and I love you too. But it's time to say goodbye. <laughs> Bye, hey, yeah, I know. <laughs> Alex needs to go and to have dinner. He's starving right now. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I think everybody's starving, right? Okay, guys. I'm so happy that I can see you one more time. Please be safe. Take care of yourself and your family. Because I might not be with you the whole model. Okay. Okay, guys. Be safe and have an amazing weekend. Yes, 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 yes,